make the thrust reverser unserviceable by deactivating the isolation control unit ICU. Remove the quick release pin from the ICU. Move the inhibit lever to the inhibition position. Put the quick release pin into the ICU to keep the inhibit lever in the inhibition position. Remove the screws and remove the lock plate from the storage bracket. Remove the inhibition bolt from the bracket. Remove the bolt attachment cover from the pivoting door. Install the bolt through the hole in the pivoting door. The longest bolt is installed in the lower door. Tighten the bolt until the door is at the same level as the structure around it. Safety the bolt with lock plate and the screws. Install the inhibition bolt attachment cover with the screws on the bracket. Repeat the operation for the upper pivoting door with the shortest bolt. Then repeat the whole procedure to inhibit the two pivoting doors of the opposite thrust reverser cowl. On the engine warning display, EWD, Make sure that the REV inhibited message is shown for the corresponding engine. To tell flight crew that the thrust reverser is inoperative, make an entry in the logbook.